A shocking geological development has unfolded on one of Europe's most dangerous volcanoes. A significant crack, one that experts say could signal a major shift inside the mountain, has opened high on the slopes of Mount Etna in Sicily. And while cracks on volcanoes are not unusual, this one is different. This one is deeper, longer, and positioned in a place that geologists have long feared would one day give way. The question now is, has that day finally arrived? Welcome to Geology Watch, your daily source for urgent Earth updates. Today's report covers the latest findings from volcanologists, the alarming implications of this newly formed fracture, and why scientists are now warning that Etna's unstable flank may be closer than ever to catastrophic failure. About a month ago, researchers monitoring Mount Etna detected something unusual near the volcano's southeastern crater, a substantial crack running across the mountain at roughly 10,000 feet of elevation. This wasn't a surface fissure caused by weather or minor lava movement. The crack was wide, clean, and deep, suggesting a structural shift far below the summit cone. The immediate concern among geologists and volcanologists was the location. This region of Etna is part of a slowly sliding mass, a vast portion of the mountain that has been inching toward the sea for decades. Scientists have measured this movement using GPS, radar, and satellite imagery, tracking the slow creep of the flank as it shifts millimeter by millimeter each year. But the appearance of a sudden fresh fracture raises the possibility that this slow, steady slide is accelerating. And if acceleration is confirmed, the implications could be serious. A crack like this can mean several things. Rising internal magma pressure forcing open weak spots, internal destabilization within the volcano's structure, increased gravitational slumping of the flank toward the Ionian Sea, or a combination of these dangerous forces acting together. Any one of these factors alone would be concerning. All of them at once could be catastrophic. For decades, Etna has been monitored more closely than almost any volcano on Earth. Yet, scientists observing this new crack note, its appearance aligns almost perfectly with long-predicted models of how the volcano's flank would begin to fail. This region of Etna, the eastern and southeastern sides, sits on a slow-moving geological slip zone. Unlike most stratovolcanoes that stand firmly on stable ground, Etna is perched partly on a layer of sediment and fractured bedrock that naturally shifts toward the sea. Over thousands of years, this movement has shaped the coastline, causing landslides, rock falls, and structural collapses. But modern technology has revealed something more troubling. Etna's flank is not only moving, it is accelerating. This new crack high on the mountain might be the first visible sign that internal pressure is joining forces with downward gravitational motion. When magma rises rapidly, it pushes outward, creating strain across the entire volcanic cone. If that pressure coincides with a slipping outer flank, the two forces can combine to trigger a massive landslide, one big enough to send millions of tons of rock into the sea in a single event. And that is exactly the scenario scientists fear. The most alarming concern tied to this crack is the possibility of a catastrophic flank collapse, something that has happened on other volcanoes in the geological past and is known to produce devastating effects. If the southeastern flank of Etna were to fail, experts say the consequences would unfold in rapid succession. The entire ESE portion of Etna is a colossal block of Earth, and a sudden collapse would send it hurtling into the Ionian Sea. This is not hypothetical. Geological surveys show deep slip planes beneath the surface capable of supporting such a collapse. The sudden removal of mass from the volcano's side can release pressure from the magma chamber. This can trigger sudden explosions, high ash plumes, lava surges, pyroclastic flows. This scenario has been documented in other flank collapsing volcanoes across history. Scientists warn that a massive ESE collapse could generate a tsunami capable of striking the coastline the city of Catania, with a population of more than 312,000, lies directly in the path of such an event. Smaller Borgos, towns, and suburban areas would face flooding, destruction, and limited evacuation time. The wave could extend well beyond local shores and impact distant communities across the Mediterranean. Etna is one of Europe's busiest airspace regions. A sudden ash release could affect flights from Italy, Malta, Greece, and even North Africa. 
This is why the situation has triggered immediate concern among officials and researchers. Mount Etna is no stranger to activity. In fact, it is one of the world's most active volcanoes. What makes this situation different is the location and size of the crack and what it reveals about the volcano's behavior beneath the surface. Scientists monitoring Etna have long confirmed that the southeast flank is sliding into the sea. This isn't speculation, it's measured, documented scientific fact. In 2018, a major international study concluded that the flank is moving at a pace and direction consistent with progressive instability. In simpler terms, the mountain is slowly detaching from its base. Now, with the appearance of this new fracture, the timeline for potential collapse has shifted from sometime in the distant future to from today forward. Authorities have responded by increasing danger levels and closing off the upper portion of the volcano above 8,000 feet. Access is now restricted due to risk of sudden activity. Researchers are analyzing deformation data, gas emissions, seismic signals, and thermal imagery to determine whether this fracture is expanding a critical indicator of imminent change. Right now, experts are watching for several key warning signs. Rapid widening of the crack. Increased tremor beneath the ESE flank. Sudden rises in SO2 emissions. Ground deformation detected by satellite scans. Accelerated slippage toward the sea. Any combination of these could indicate that the SESE flank. Flank is preparing for a significant shift. However, scientists also emphasize that cracks can form without immediate collapse. The challenge is predicting the tipping point, the moment when pressure, gravity, and structural weakness combine to overcome the volcano's remaining stability. That moment is impossible to pinpoint, but the new crack confirms what researchers have said for years. Mount Etna's flank will collapse. The only unknown is when. The situation at Mount Etna is evolving. And updates are expected in the coming days and weeks as researchers continue to assess the fracture and its movement. Here on Geology Watch, we will follow every new development, every scan, every change in tremor pattern, and every alert issued by authorities and volcanological institutions. If you live near Etna or anywhere along the Sicilian coastline, staying informed is crucial. While no one can predict the exact moment of a collapse or eruption, Awareness and preparedness are your greatest tools. Thank you for watching. Stay alert, stay informed, and as always, this is Geology Watch, monitoring the Earth so you don't have to.